Our family has lived in this community for almost a hundred years. Um, we still farm some ground that was uh, brought into our family from the early generations. We, we love uh, working with Mother Nature. We like the cattle business. We like to, to nurture cattle along and, and provide a, a product for the consumers <clears throat> and in our crops. Um, we enjoy watching uh, the uh, crops grow from a seed to fruition to where we're harvesting. But it, it, it's a way of life and, and it's a great opportunity to work together and to raise a family. Our ultimate customer is our consumer. And we provide, we work very hard to provide a product that is very safe and wholesome to our consumer. Our families live here, we've lived here for generations, we'll continue to live here for generations. So we're very, very careful in what we do environmentally. Uh, we want to make sure that we take care of the assets that we use to provide those, that beef. And, and we're very, very sensitive because we eat our own beef every day. We live on this land and we drink our water. And so it's very important to us that we do everything correctly so that there are no environmental issues, no health issues. As, as we feed cattle, of course, uh, we have a lot of manure that is produced through the production of our beef. We use that manure to reapply back to our crop farmland. We analyze, we take soil samples of our uh, cropland and take uh, samples of our uh, manure that's produced. Uh, it, it is a full circle kind of business. Uh, we produce manure. Uh, in our environment we're composting that manure. Uh, so the compost is then land applied on land that we own uh, and then through the use of best management practices and then the crops are harvested and uh, fed back to the cattle and in turn the cattle create or produce manure and, and the cycle starts over again. You know, in our environment, in addition to operating a 22,000 head feed yard, uh, we've got about 2,100 total acres of land mass. Uh, most of that land mass has some kind of a growing crop uh, and as a result of that uh, is able to utilize uh, some of some and, and negate some of the carbon credit uh, impacts uh, of the greenhouse gases that are produced and I think having a, a buffer zone around our feed yard uh, provides appeal uh, but it makes us sleep better at night knowing that uh, that land mass is helping to utilize uh, some of the greenhouse gases that are produced in this operation.